Stay with us as we take you on a journey of 20 moments you must see before you die. A man was having a good day's sleep near a pool in his house when a bear broke into the house. The bear came near the man and started rubbing the man's foot with its paw. The man woke up and the bear ran away. The very first thing the man did after waking up is what he reached out for his phone and started recording a video of the bear. It was surely a wake-up call for this man. Thousands of animals have died as a result of bushfires in Sydney's forests. A kangaroo's hands were burned in one of these wildfires. When a woman standing nearby spotted this miserable creature, she decided to do something about it by pouring water on the burnt hands. Since the poor kangaroo was desperate, he stood calmly as the woman held him and then poured water on the burnt hand. A woman named Susan Anderson gave birth in a hospital parking lot. After she went into labor, Susan and her husband Joseph rushed to Natural Birth Works in Margate, Florida. Susan took only a few steps toward the building before giving birth right there in the parking lot with the help of a midwife, Sandra LeBain. When Sandra saw the woman struggling, she quickly ran outside to help the poor woman. She created a comfortable environment so that the mother could give birth easily without panicking. After the baby started crying, both of them were taken inside the hospital for further procedure. Landslides happen when a slope or a section of it goes through a series of events that cause it to change from stable to unstable. A video was recorded in Jamaica where a large number of trees can be seen coming down during a deadly landslide. It felt like the whole mountain was coming down because the landslide was so enormous. Even the trees felt like sticks coming down and a large piece of land vanished in front of the recorder's eyes. With his microlight aircraft, Christian Mollick has guided migratory flocks of endangered bird species for more than 20 years. He oversees endangered species migratory flocks with his microlight aircraft. Mollick describes his great work as a tribute to Mother Nature. Mollick now takes tourists on brief trips with the birds to share his emotional experience with them. Tourists contribute to the success of his conservation effort. Beavers have been working on trees in Canada's Wood Buffalo National Park for decades, and their efforts have paid off. These furry builders constructed the world's biggest beaver dam. The dam, which stretches for about 800 meters, is enormous enough to be visible from space. It remained concealed in the Alberta wilderness until 2007, when a researcher using Google Earth uncovered it. Skeet shooting is a fun and competitive sport in which participants use shotguns to break clay targets that are mechanically thrown into the air from two fixed points at high speeds and from various angles. In the video, a group of five men can be seen skeet shooting from different angles. The men are experts in this amazing sport and can be seen destroying clay targets while doing push-ups. One of them even put a basketball into the basket using a shotgun. Now that's what we call being pro at something. Bottle flipping is a trend that involves throwing a plastic bottle, typically partially full of liquid, into the air so that it rotates in an attempt to land it upright on its base or cap. In this video, a group of men can be seen flipping bottles using different techniques and showcasing their talent. They use baseball bats, fishing lines to flip the bottles, and can flip four bottles at a time using their hands. Two dogs can be seen attacking a bull in this video. Nobody told the dogs which side to attack a bull from, so they made the exact mistake they weren't supposed to do. As they stood in front of the bull's horns, the bull launched both dogs into the air with his horns. Bow fishing is a type of fishing that involves shooting and retrieving fish using specialized archery equipment. Fish are shot with a barbed arrow attached to a reel fixed on the bow or crossbow with a specific line. A man named Steven Banizak in the video uses a bow and shoots at a fish down in the lake. The arrow hits the fish in the gills and he pulls the fish onto the bridge. Steven made the world record of bow fishing. Right in the gills actually. Boom! Ice skating is one of the most beautiful sports in the world. In the Vancouver Olympics 2010, a couple with their very exquisite and outclass performance, this couple of ice skaters astonished the spectators. The couple was effortlessly delivering a magical performance on the ice rink. The man was holding the woman on his shoulders while moving on the ice and the audience were awestruck by this beautiful performance. 
You might have seen many bicycle races, but this one is truly epic. Monkeys perform a lot of different tricks and are known to be very clever animals, but I think you haven't seen so many monkeys driving a bicycle at the same moment anywhere. In a circus of Thailand, these amazing clever creatures were seen driving their little bicycles with ease. A video that went viral showed a squirrel standing on two legs and begging for water from people. A squirrel in need of water follows a guy standing on the side of the road with a bottle of water. The squirrel pursues the guy until he provides her with a glass of water. The poor thirsty squirrel drank all the water she could get her hands on, and we're sure she praised God for bringing this savior into her life. On its way home, a scorpion came upon an ant and ate it. He then invaded an ant colony by attacking individual ants, splitting them in half and consuming them. As long as the ants were not agitated, it was straightforward for him. As soon as they realized they were being assaulted, they ran to fight this scorpion. Dozens of ants who went after the scorpion ate him alive. At the end, the scorpion suffered a humiliating loss. An electric eel and a caiman had a very horrifying encounter near a lake. The caiman closes its jaws around the eel's throat. However, it turned out to be a terrible miscalculation since the eel shocked the caiman for a long time at extremely high voltage. After being unable to endure the shocks, the caiman dies in misery. Well, I wouldn't recommend thinking of an electric eel as an easy target. Turtles are adorable creatures that are completely harmless, unless you mess with them. A turtle can be seen resting on the ground while a horse stands nearby. When the horse poked the turtle with his head, the turtle felt pretty much threatened. The horse was bitten in the mouth by the turtle, and we can see the horse running hurriedly. That's what we call a deadly bite. When a snake crawled into a bulldog's yard and attacked the bulldog, he made a terrible mistake. The bulldog, however, dodged the attack and then counterattacked the snake by grasping it from its back and shaking it brutally, resulting in the snake's death. The snake will now be familiar with the strength of a thousand pound bite. Domesticated cats are afraid of almost anything, whereas wild cats are not afraid of anything. A cheetah attacked a caiman, and that was a mistake. Caimans, in reality, live near the banks of rivers and may be quite dangerous if disturbed. The cheetah attacked this caiman, but it spun around and bit the cheetah on the nose, causing him to flee. This video serves as a warning to all humans. If you want to attack or mess with a caiman, you should bring the cavalry along. And now let us move on to our subscriber pick of the day. This image was sent to us by a subscriber. Similarly, if you ever wish to know more about an image you come across, just send it to us. Who knows, we might even feature it in one of our videos. Today's subscriber pick is a picture of a tsunami wave hitting the Fukushima nuclear plant in Japan. The Fukushima nuclear disaster was a 2011 nuclear accident at the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear power plant in Okuma, Fukushima Prefecture, Japan. The proximate cause of the disaster was the 2011 Tohoku earthquake and tsunami. It was the most severe nuclear accident since the Chernobyl disaster in 1986. In the days after the accident, radiation released into the atmosphere forced the government to declare an ever larger evacuation zone around the plant, culminating in an evacuation zone with a 20-kilometer radius. 154,000 residents evacuated from the communities surrounding the plant due to the rising off-site levels of ambient ionizing radiation. On the set of Guinness World Records Special in Beijing, China in January 2016, students from Zhanggao Martial Arts School competed against Tagao rivals to see who could break the record for the most individuals in front flip from a trampoline onto a platform in one minute. Both the groups got two chances and the Zhanggao Martial Arts School won and made the world record by doing 37 forward flips in a minute, beating their rivals by just one flip. Thank you very much for watching the video. Do like and share it with your friends. Subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to not miss any of the upcoming amazing videos. Thank you once again.